8 overview during this week, we are going to talk about the first lesson of the second unit, which is body organization, levels of organization. So identify the concept of body organization and level of organization. So this is the first video that we are going to be watching together. Okay. And also we have here an interactive worksheet on the topic of levels of organization. This is a wiser me. A worksheet that you have to log in with your personal account. So also we have here about the levels of organization, cell tissue organs, Human and beings, organ system. Like most people, to perform a particular function. Here we have flashcards on the same topic. Further practice, those are scolded questions with answers in it. Also we have here a self-assessment for the levels of organization. Moving to the other lesson, which is um, human organ system part one, which is going to be talking about the control system. So during this lesson, we are going to explore the concept of human control system that is divided over the nervous system and the endocrine system. So those are the two systems Hello, that we are going buddy. to be talking about. Our nervous about system mainly. controls everything we do, including breathing, smell. Also, we have here interactive worksheet on the same matter. We also have the endocrine system. Very stems off of the hypothalamus. Okay, and the Quizlet. Okay, so I have to talk about one thing that those we are going to study them in details on lesson three about the human body systems. Here is just an introduction about each uh, body system. What does it do? Okay, and here we have the further practice about it. Also moving to the other part, which is the structural system. Here we are going to talk about the skeletal, muscular, and integumentary system. So we're going to talk about the integumentary yes, system. Of Those are interactive worksheets. Those are wiser me ones. And here we have the muscular system. Hello, friend. It's made up. Okay, and also Quizlet, which are flashcards for easier understanding. And here we have the further practice, three, uh, two uh, further practice questions with answers and a self-assessment about muscular system. And here we have also the challenging question about the same topic. So lastly, we have the body organization. So this is technically talks about oxygen and transport system. We are going to explore the concept of human oxygen and transport system. So we're going to talk about the respiratory system and the circulatory system. So those, once again, those are briefly explaining the main function of them as we are going to go through them in much details later on during the chapter. So also we have here um, two further practice and self-assessment and the challenging question. Also we have here the last part, which is food waste and processing uh, system. We have here the digestive system and the exertory system.